So today I'm going to share with you the number one muscle that is tight on most people, which is causing low back pain. So if you have low back pain, I'm going to show you how to release this muscle to help relieve and reduce that back pain. Hey, I'm Nathan Crane with Crane Factor, and we bring you programs, products, and inspiration on healthy living, fitness training, and creating an amazing life. And yes, there is a muscle that we all have that causes low back pain. And this is caused because of what? Because we sit far too damn often. What it's doing is tightening all of our muscles. And so what happens when you're sitting hours and hours a day over months and years, there's one muscle that continuously tightens that starts pulling on your low back. And what is that? That is the psoas muscle. Here's my little diagram of your body, all right? So your head really wouldn't be right here, but let's say this is you. Your head would be like way up here, but the whiteboard's not big enough. So let's say this is you. This is your lower vertebra right here, okay? And the psoas connects to the femur bone, runs up to the hip, and connects to these low vertebra here, right? It's a pretty big muscle group. It's attached here to your lower vertebra, comes through here and attaches to the femur, right? So there's also psoas major and then there's a smaller portion of it called the psoas minor. I'm not that great of an artist, so hopefully you can understand this diagram, but basically it runs up behind your intestines, behind your organs, and connects to your low back. So what happens when it's attached to your femur and that muscle starts to tighten? You got it, right? It starts pulling your low back down and in, starts compressing these vertebrae together, makes you more prone to having bulging discs, which are gonna be pinching against nerves, gonna be causing that low back pain. So what we need to do is we need to lengthen this out. We also need to strengthen it. There are a lot of stretches, a lot of exercises you can do, like we have in our 21 day back fix, which will help this. I'm gonna show you one of the main ones that's gonna help you right now, okay? So, just get on the ground, put your knee back, left knee forward, and you're gonna start leaning in to that front knee, all right? What I like to do first, especially if you're cold, your body's not warmed up, is just pulse. Do 13 to 20 pulses to start warming it up and then get in there and hold that. Hold that for 30 seconds up to a minute. If you really want to start creating structural change and muscle change, hold that for up to two to three minutes at a time, okay? If you need to get deeper into it, you can really lean forward into that front knee like this. Really feel that whole psoas muscle, you'll feel it there start to lengthen. And then switch and do the exact same thing on the other side. Again, pulse at least 13 times, warm it up, and then lean in, hold it for a minute, upwards of two to three minutes. Do each side equally. Do this once to twice a day, you'll start seeing some benefits. You can also do the standing version, which I really like, which is here, really pushing that hip flexor backwards, spine straight, knee moving forward. And from right here, you can also get the outside of the hip by taking that outside arm and rotating and leaning over to the opposite side. So now we're getting the outside and the inside, which will also help reduce and relieve that back pain. All right, do the same thing on the other side. Again, pulse and then hold. Doing this each day is really gonna help. Additionally, if you want an entire program where we walk you through the exercises, the stretches, the movements, everything you need to really create that strong, healthy, flexible, mobile back, check out our 21 Day Back Fix program. We'll put in the link below. Other than that, try this stretch. It'll definitely help you out with that psoas muscle, help with that low back pain. So thanks for tuning in. If you're not subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button. If you got some good tips, please like and share this video, and we'll talk to you tomorrow. Take care.